This is the King from Siggy Forge, and I've been fencing with it for the last four or five months. Here are my initial impressions. I like this sword. First of all, I like the look. It is a shiltless fetter. It looks like a real sword, and I love that. It also fences well. Like all Siggy's, it has a ton of flex in the blade, which means it's a very safe defense with you. You're not gonna hurt anybody in the thrust unless you're a total jerk. It also feels good in the cut. It's got a good point of balance, and it's very maneuverable. It does have a good amount of blade presence because it's thicker, but that's good. It means that if you have good structure, you can dominate people's swords in the bind or while cutting. Initially, I was having some problems with the sword being too flexy and parries cuts in the bind, but I found out that that was actually my fault. So if you have improper edge alignment or structure, the sword will flop around, it'll feel unwieldy, and it won't give you the desired result. But if you use correct structure and technique, the sword feels just fine and it works perfectly. So not only is it a good sword, it can make you a better swordsman.